I'm back here with Jordan Double M J O. No worry. Um, I just got a couple questions for you. First question: Why'd you pick Howard? Um, my pops went here, so uh, I feel like it was history and like in the story itself. Mm -hmm. So it's fake been destined in my life, I guess, to come here. Yeah. Yeah. I was fucking with the culture, so I was like, let me try it. Let me see what's about. I picked Howard because I love the community that it provides, especially as a black individual, and I'm just so excited I get to be a part of it. That's a good answer. Um, I picked Howard because, not gonna lie, actually, I didn't know about HBCUs until like, like junior, like when I was applying for college, and I, I applied to Howard like last, like Howard and Spelman were the only two HBCUs I applied to. I applied to them last, but I was like, okay, let me actually like look into the school and like, what's it about? I looked up HBCUs, I'm like, okay, like this is where my people be at, like, I can't be nowhere else. So I was like, okay, and it's in DC, I'm from Maryland, I wanted somewhere close, low key, so I was like, okay, like how it is, we'll see where it takes me, and I love it. I mainly picked Howard because I am a journalism major, I'm a sophomore, and I feel like, um, I don't know, the journalism program here is really well, especially like in the school of communications in general, so I definitely chose Howard mainly because of my major, also because the environment we're in and around our people, and it's because, you know, we're the real HU, we're the best. Yeah. <laughs> I'll pick Howard mainly because of the financial aid. I wanted to go to ANC, but I didn't get no money. But what? What did he say? What? I personally chose Howard because I thrive best around my peers, and I wanted to be surrounded by Black excellence and really just struggle with the people that I work for. Um, I agree as well. Honestly, I just wanted to be surrounded by my people and get opportunities provided to me by my people. Um, my brother was here, so I came up to visit him one summer, and I liked it. So I said I'm going to come here. No worries. Um, I picked Tower because I'm a legacy. My mom and my dad went here, so you know I just always wanted to come here because I saw them as successful Black people, and that's who I've been surrounded with. Yeah. Well, I'm from LA, so I, I figure like coming all the way out here, I get a different experience. You know what I'm saying? Like I can learn anywhere, but I might as well come to a place that got history and I can make like an everlasting experience. So. All right, and and I actually went to school in California too. You know what I'm saying? 13 black people out like 3,000 kids. <laughs> but you know what I'm saying? Did try to get around some black people. You know what I'm saying? Get around the culture. You know? Yeah. Howard with choice. I picked Howard because so I moved to the U.S. like eight years ago, mm -hmm. but I'm African. From you feel where? me? I'm from Equatorial Guinea. Oh, okay, Senegal. Oh, for real? You speak French? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I was okay, about to bust out a little song song. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so then when we moved to the U.S., like, I live in a predominantly white county, all Asians, all white, and um, I just missed home for real. Yeah. And I visited Howard one time on my birthday. It felt right. Um, I picked Howard essentially because I wanted to get, like study a curriculum with black people in it. Yeah. If you could be a flavor of ice cream, what flavor would you be? Hmm. I would definitely say strawberry cheesecake. Cause you know you got the strawberry and then the ice cream. Some strawberry cheesecake ice cream be having graham crackers. You know, it's just a combination of all different flavors. So I would do that. Cookies and cream. Cookies and cream. <laughs> okay. I feel like I'll be strawberry. Like I like. I feel like people underestimate. That's the common ice. theme today. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. But I just think it's sweet, it's light, it's it's good. I probably say cookies and cream. Mm -hmm. Everybody like cookies is. and cream. Yes, <laughs> right. I was gonna say cookies and cream, but if y'all know, y'all know if you go to Baskin Robbins and get the Snickers ice cream, that go crazy. Mm, we gotta try that. He just put us on y'all. Chocolate. Chocolate? Chocolate's Why? the best. Look, I like my ice cream, my cake. Chocolate, just how I like my women. Mm. There we go. Chocolate fudge, caramel, hot peanut butter. I love every flavor of black women. I love black women. Hands down, this is the number one ice cream flavor. Let's talk about it. Chocolate chip cookie dough. I don't want to hear anything else. I'm sorry. Mine's basic because my favorite is basic. Vanilla. I agree. <laughs> Which cream would you be? Strawberry. Strawberry? You know, would I like or would I be? Which would you one? be? Oh, um... I'm not gonna lie, if you had the Cold Stone, um, it's like a strawberry shortcake almost, but it's like strawberry whipped cream and graham cracker crumbles in it. Mm -hmm. It's so good. That's like the fourth time someone has said strawberry ice cream yeah, today. So, so. Chocolate. Okay. chocolate, all day, every day, all day, every day. <laughs> okay. Well, um, 
I would be cookies and cream. Cookies and cream. Cookies and cream. I love cookies and cream. Yeah. That's a good choice. Yeah. Tastes too good. Like, everything cookies and cream though. Yeah. Everything. Oh, <laughs> uh, see, so you know what? Ooh. Oh, they getting, oh, oh my they, God, my LBs. They up. My LBs, no! <laughs> okay, um, but pretty much, um, the reason, I, I, wonder, I, I think the ice cream I'll probably be, it's going to be an unpopular opinion, okay. but I'll be um, mint chocolate chip. Me too! No! I mean, mint chocolate chip, like, you know, like, it's just smooth for real, for real. It's really a slept on, like, ice cream for real. And, you know, I'm a just slept on person. I'm a slept on person, so, you know, and, but here's the thing is. You want to join them? You can come back. Okay. <laughs> um, last question, how you doing today? I'm chilling. Allergies is killing me, but, for me, we talking it. It's that season. OD. Yeah. All right. You from New York? Yeah. Mm, I can hear it. Where you from? <laughs> Philly. Uh, Okay, um, last question. How are you doing today? I'm doing very good. In a good mood. Just left work, made some money, so now I'm about to come outside, get lit, have a good day. I'm doing good. Thank okay, you. that's it. Thank you. Thank you. Doing great. Glad to be outside. Glad to be outside. You're doing great, you know what I'm saying? Got the Sigmas out here, you know what I'm saying? All right. All right. Hey, Sigmas run the yard. Sigmas run Howard's yard, just so you know. You know what I'm saying? Dang. He ain't agree with that. Woo! <laughs> <laughs>